Pareto accounting's dynamic connectivity with embedded VPN means that our system doesn't retain a fixed connection to the database when you're not transacting. As a result, our system is not susceptible to power surges or fluctuations like other accounting software packages that support wireless networks. Therefore, as a user, I could be logged onto my system connected to my network and processing a sales invoice as an example. You can see that my network connection is on and I'm going to add an additional item to this invoice. So I'm going to browse for an inventory item and view the item image. So that's the correct item. Then I click on OK to select it. And as an illustration, I'm just going to open my network and sharing center and turn my wireless connection off. This means that I'm not connected to any network. I've lost my connection. If I try and change the price list for this item, if I try and browse for a price list, this means that the system is fetching data from the database. Therefore, that's why this error message comes up. It's not connecting to my server. So I click on continue. And you'll notice that even though the system is not connecting to the server, it doesn't log me out or throw me out of the system. So I'll have to log in again. And whilst I wait for my connection to get back up, I'm able to assign a department, a document status type, as well as a salesperson, or capture any additional information. I'm also able to bookmark this document. So if I'm processing a new sales invoice or any other document, I'm able to refer back to this document, as well as add a reference number. These functions that I'm adding now do not need me to transact or fetch any data from the database. That's why I'm able to continue adding them. And after adding the reference number, I'm going back to my network and sharing center and I'm going to turn my wireless connection on again. Just turn my connection on and minimize the screen. As you can see, my wireless connection is on. I'm going to go to my price list, choose a different price list for this item. Then I click on OK. And I want to add another line, but instead I'm going to go to a bookmarked document. Select one line from that document. When I select OK, it gets added onto my sales invoice. So I just referred back to a bookmark document. On document options, I'm just going to add um, my defined user defined fields rather. Capture information on my user defined fields. And on printing, I select to print the invoice copy and the original invoice document. And I record without any errors. When we go to the control panel, and check the data integrity, you'll see that my data has passed all integrity checks, despite having lost my network connection at some point. So whilst we're on this data integrity screen, let's do a quick recap. The only downtime was during the power outage, or rather when I lost connection to my network. Therefore, when I get my power back up again, I resume processing as normal. You'll notice that I didn't need to log back into the system again, I did not lose any of my data and there was no data corruption. This means that there was no downtime whilst I was getting my data fixed and I also did not need to incur any additional consulting costs. There was no theft, no loss in staff productivity whilst my data is getting fixed and there was no need to switch to and from manual systems whilst I was getting my data fixed. In conclusion, with our solid stability, we're able to offer you a three-year money-back guarantee on data corruption. And this means that your business maintains maximum uptime at all times.